Ross, sauce it up. Pull up in a riot, yeah, he painted with some decals. I ain't never stopped, can't be trusting any females. Hey guys, Twist here, and today, welcome back to episode 2 of Pokemon Brilliant Di Diamond Shinies Only playthrough. Yes, guys, I cannot express it enough. Episode 1 has over 1,000 views and it's still climbing. I know this video probably won't get as many views, of course. I don't care. It, it's, it is what it is, man. I'm just happy I got a video that got a lot of traction. And yeah, it was an awesome video because I got a shiny. <laughs> but guess what? We got another one. I literally got the shiny about 10 minutes ago and decided to just hop on the recording. So go. I'm going to go ahead and play the clip for you guys now so you guys can see it. So here's the clip. Yes! 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 Shiny Shanks, guys! Let's go! Yes! Finally! Oh, come on. Okay. Okay, we're gonna get it. We're gonna use a tackle. Oh my god. Jesus. Oh man. Jeez. Oh, oh, dude. Use a Pokeball. Oh my gosh. Let's go! Let's go! Guys, let's go! Second shiny of the playthrough, baby! Let's go! Yes. Alright, guys, welcome Nala to the team. Shiny Shanks, full odds, baby. Let's go! And yes, guys, I do already have a shiny Shinx in my sword and shield. And weirdly enough, today, the day I'm recording this, is community day for Shinx and Pokemon Go. So, it's only fitting that I got a shiny Shinx as the second member of our team, guys. So yes, shiny Shinx. I got Nala, my first ever female shiny Shinx, which is really cool. So, I now have the other version. Because I have the male one. So yeah, Nala is the second member of our shiny only team. Which is super cool. So now I can actually progress. I've been, I've spent like two days shiny hunting for anything really. I was counting for Badoo as you guys saw in the clip. But, you know, I think we can attempt to take on the Rock Gem with the team we have now. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that. Hopefully today, maybe. So, next stop, Orenburg City, which is over here. So, it looks like we're going to have to um, we're gonna have to battle some people, which is super cool. I did get the uh, Pokey Catch, is what it's called, or whatever it's called. Which is cool. I mean, it was a fairly easy. You just had to talk to a couple clowns. But, yeah. There we go. That's pretty cool. Hey, Barry, what's up? Let's battle it out. Yo, this is good. Now that I think about it, Barry's going to have a uh, Piplup. If Barry has Piplup, that makes Nala really effective. Cool. That makes us have a... We already got a Pokemon that can beat Barry's main. Critical hit, nice. Don't get cocky, kid. This isn't over. <laughs> I know this isn't over. Nala is really low leveled, though. Level 6. I'm taking it that his Piplup's going to be around level 8 to 10. But let's see. Let's see what happens. Going 
with the Piplup. Level 9, so I was pretty close there. Level 6 versus level 9, but I think Nala is going to be more effective here. It would be cool that since I got the shiny starter, he got his starter shiny as, like, as well. That would be pretty cool. But that's not how it works. Another Thundershock. Let's see if we can get a Paralysis off. No, not yet. I'm gonna keep using the Growl. Interesting. Interesting battle choice, man. Keep using that Thundershock. No Paralysis yet, though. But we did get a crit. My Pokemon's HP is low. This could be a bit tight. Is he gonna have Potions? Pound doesn't do much. Surprisingly. But Thundershock's gonna keep taking damage. There we go. This should be enough to KO it. There we go. That's what we're talking about, guys. Way to go, Nala. Level 8. And learn Charge. That's a good move. So, there is one big problem. The reason why I was hunting Badoo is because the first gem is uh, Rock. So, I don't exactly know how we're going to do this. I would like to think that Chimchar has enough like power, but I'm not sure. Oh, hello. What's up, dude? Alright, what we got? One Pokemon. Youngster Dallas. Cricketot. That was one I was shiny hunting because I was shiny hunting last night. But no luck, sadly. Look at Caesar's backflip, though. Boom. One hit KO. Look at that. Level 11 for Caesar now. That's, that's good. So it appears we're going in a cave. Oh, this is all, this is gonna go splendid. I guess we can use this as, oh, technical machines. What is it? Rock smash. This may just saved our butts. Use hidden move rock smash with your pokey catch. Pokey sketch, pokey catch, whatever. Okay, I wonder if we can get Caesar to learn that move. Can learn rock smash. Let's go. We're gonna replace Leer with a rock smash. All right, that's what that's that's cool. That should that kind of gives me uh like makes me feel better about the rock gem now. But I mean, I can't tell you guys the video of the shiny chimchar has blown up. Like compared to my other videos. Of course it's not getting like thousands and thousands, but compared to like all my other videos, this is it's insane. It's absolutely insane. Hello. Alright, he's going to show me where the gym is, but we already know I've played Diamond and Pearl. The gym leader's not there. He's mining. All right. Hey, Barry. What's up? Right here. So, long gone now. He's in the mine. Okay. Let's head down to the mine. Oh, keep walking around. Oh, wild encounter. Okay, let's see what we find. Geodude, that's pretty cool. Obviously, I'm not going to hunt the Kanto Pokemon at all. I'm going to try to avoid it because I'm doing the whole Let's Go Shiny only playthrough. Which is still happening. I'm just working on getting fossils, if any of you are wondering. So, don't worry. I'm just trying to get Aerodactyl, Kabuto, and Omnanite Shiny. Which is taking forever. But, there he is. There's first gym leader. What's up, guy? 
He's showing me how to use Rock Smash. Cool. Oh, you can't do Rock Smash until you beat the first gym. Gotcha. Do we want to go back and battle anybody just to kind of get some extra XP, or do we just want to go for it? All right, after going through and doing some um, battling, some of the trainers that I skipped over, and also battling some more trainers in the mine, I think I come up with a good theory. So, here we go. Caesar's level 13, and power-up punch is good. Because, because for the rock-type Pokemon, fighting types are super effective, like fighting moves. So if I use power-up punch, it then builds up my attack and makes my next hit hit harder and harder and harder. And yeah, so hopefully he can just, all he needs to do now is withstand getting hit by rock moves. Which is the the one thing that I'm worried about. So we'll just, we'll just try it. See what happens. We're still gotta battle these guys, so we'll get some extra levels and maybe, uh, maybe evolve? I don't know when he evolves. But this should definitely help us out with a power-up punch. So first power-up punch does some damage, and then it builds up the attack. Defense curl, so that's going to build up his defense. So we're still not too terrible when it comes to the whole uh, getting hit by rock moves yet. Another power-up punch, and it builds up the attack again. Tackle, we can take that. We can take a tackle. And then this power-up punch should KO. It does. Good. Let's go. That's the first guy down. Still doesn't love, uh, get to the level 14 yet. Not bad. So the next guy. Let's see what he's got. got two Pokemon. I'm guessing Geodude and Onix. That's why I'm taking my guess. It's going to be Geodude and Onix. Power up punch. That does even more. Look at that. Well, he's also a lower level. So, that Geodude is. Tackle. Shouldn't do too much. Power up punch again. Sweet. Uh, not level 14 yet. We're not switching. We're keeping Caesar in for Onyx. Another level 8 though, but we already got the power of punches built up. So, does more damage. So as it builds up against the gym leader's Pokemon, by the time we get to his best Pokemon, we should be doing relatively good so I think we got this there we go we should get to level 14 now so that's cool there we go that's what I'm talking about Caesar is evolving! Yes! My first time seeing a Pokemon evolve in this game. Oh, it's very much like the DS's evolution screen. Man, Caesar looks like a beast. Alright, there we go. We got the Monferno on the sprite now. Dude, looking good. Mock Punch. What's Mock Punch? Move always goes first. Can we get rid of Rock Smash? Yes, let's get rid of Rock Smash from Mock Punch. So if we have that one little extra like attack that we need to hit first, we can do it. Alright, here we go. We're gonna go after the first gym leader. Need to see your potential as a Pokemon trainer. First up, Geodude. Cool. So we've already... No, we can take down Geodudes. But we got the shiny Monferno now. Look at it. 
power up punch. Let's see what we can do here. Half damage. And the attack builds up. Stealth Rock. Good move. I love that move. But we ain't planning on switching out. Power up punch again. His speed is unmatched. And the attack builds up. Nala's level 12. Oh, of course you can learn Bite. Get rid of Tackle for Bite. Sure, why not? Let's do it. Alright, next up. Onyx. We have experiences with Onyx too, so. Power up punch again. Almost one hit KO. Almost. Rock throw. Oh god. Nothing? Nothing? Oh, I think it's because he got. He actually got the fighting ability. Like, fighting. Like, uh, type now. That he evolved. <gasps> yes! Oh, yeah, we got this. We got this in the bag. Cranidos. Cranidos is a cool Pokemon. I wonder if you're gonna be able to shiny hunt it. Mold Breaker. Power Up Punch. Ooh, one hit. KO. Get out. Well, that's what we're talking about, guys. And that is the first gym in Pokemon Brilliant Diamond defeated. That's what I'm talking about. Got my first badge. You received the coal badge from Rourke. Ooh, TM76. Stealth Rock? I said I like that move. Obtain the stickers that Rourke uses. Oh, we'll get like the rock type um ball capsule. Sweet. Go ahead and save the game. Hey, we'll go ahead and end it off here. Why not? So, guys, thank you so much again for the first episode getting so many views. I really am pumped about it. And, yeah, guys, like I said, the episodes are going to come as I get shinies. So, I am going to be shiny hunting next after this, gym. But I'll probably record first part of episode 3 and then shiny hunt and then pick it up. So you guys will be seeing episode 3, I don't know when, sometime soon, hopefully. But yeah guys, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to drop a like if you guys enjoyed. And leave a comment, let me know how you guys are doing in Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. Let me know like what shinies you've gotten. Like Just tell me, tell me what you're up to. I like to hear it. But yeah guys, thank you guys for watching. Peace out and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye <laughs>